guys welcome back today we got a brand new package in from china it's the uh, 90cc piston for the 90cc pit bike of course and these are the rings for it gaskets clips and the pin the problem with the 90cc pit bike was that it was smoking a lot so i guess it is the piston and maybe the valve seals but we can change both and then it will be fine so right now we will go to the garage and we will see uh, what's wrong with the engine because we will take the top end off and have a look so we got the piston rings installed right now uh, if you want to know how to install piston rings you can check this video right here and uh, now we uh, will take apart the engine and let's see if this is the problem or uh, what's the problem so so there it is uh, let's take off the top end of this engine to see what's the problem So we will start by taking off the exhaust. Let's take off the cylinder to have a look at the piston. We have to remove the uh, chain tensioner right here. That's really easy. Just loosen up this 10 mil bolt. Just like this. And now it should come off. Give it a little tap. Pretty crusty. This is the tensioner. The cylinder is in pretty good shape, that's amazing. Because we only have a brand new piston, so great. And the piston. Yes, these rings are really, really bad. Look at this. Let's take it off. So if you have a look at this piston, the rings are completely gone. So thin they are. Look. But I'm happy that this is great, great condition. So let's take off the gaskets and uh, put the new piston in and have a look at the uh, false seals. So now let's have a look at the valve seals. For that we have to take off these arms. And then we can remove the springs with this spring compressor for valve springs. First let's remove this, these two. screw just a normal screw this is something with this but it doesn't have to have that just normal screw screw it in and pull this out so then you search the correct uh, sizes make a little bit of room and put on this side the small one the big one on top has to have a little bit more room, so let me fix that, just like this, like this, perfect. And then you can compress the spring. Start tightening the, sc the spring, and you have to have a little magnet like this to pick out these. these little keepers 
now it will come out I think yes these are the little keepers don't lose them <laughs> very important now we can loosen up this whole assembly so we eventually can replace the valve seals that's our goal right here so like this there you see the spring will get just like that put it right here and here you have the red seal there right there around the valve so let's take out the valve and have a look it's good to replace the valve seal let me search for a new valve seal right now give me a second So these are the new So what you do then, you put the screwdriver through it Screwdriver like this Put it in the hole right there Now you have to press it on a little bit difficult but let's see we got the brand new green valve seal in and now it's the same thing to uh, put things back put it in here slide it through make sure the valve seal stays in place when you pop it in like this these are the springs Just like that, then the compressor back on. And now let's see if we can get these clips back. Always a little bit hard to get them right. But so when you get the retaining clips back in, you uh, decompress the spring and then they stay in place. So now we can put this uh, back together again so right now i will do the exact same thing uh, on the exhaust port so guys i came across an awesome channel that uh, learned me how to rebuild such a cylinder head of a uh, honda type of uh, engine and it's a really awesome channel it shows you a lot of uh, detailed information about the cylinder heads and how to install it correctly i tried my be best to explain it but uh, Obviously this video is uh, way more detailed so I will link uh, his channel in the description and the video uh, that shows how you can rebuild the cylinder head so so I would say have a look at this channel and uh, see what you think about it. So now let's go back to the pit bike and let's finish it off. So the cylinder head is back together right now so now we can go and uh, put these little caps on and then uh, change the piston and put the cylinder on so so we got the cylinder on now let's put the tension back yes get back on brand new one just like this smash it on so the timing is right now so let's put the uh, cover back on brand new gasket so now the timing is right we can put these little cups back on and start her up so we got it put together I saved some clips that were a little bit boring I just skipped ahead and uh, just did it myself like these things putting these things on air filter exhaust so but right now it should start up, so let's have a look. So 
So I'm really excited that it doesn't smoke anymore. So next video we will be riding this thing. So stay tuned. So guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, in next part we will be testing this thing out and driving it. So stay tuned.